हेलो गुड मॉर्निंग माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स हाउ आर यू फाइन दैट्स ग्रेट डियर स्टूडेंट्स वी आर नाउ गोइंग टू स्टार्ट कोर्स ऑफ इंग्लिश एंड द नाइन्थ यूनिट यूनिट नंबर नाइन सिंगल सॉन्ग ऑफ पीपल लास्ट एपिसोड डिसाइड एंड एक्सप्लेन दिस पॉम Today we learn question and answers. Reading is fun. Question number one: Which modes of transport do the people use to move around in the city? Answer: In the city, people use cars, taxis, buses, trams, trams, rickshaws. extra to move around question number 2 what are the thing that the people carry with them while moving around while moving around people carry bags briefcase suitcase and etc question number 3 Where all do you find these very busy people? I find all these busy people on roads, on bus stops, on sidewalks, in market, etc. Question number four: Where have you seen crowds of people? I have seen crowds of people at railway stations. bus stand shopping malls stadium cinema halls fairs and etc question number 5 why do you think all these people are in a hurry answer because they have to do many things and they have to go long distance okay understand reading is fun good now language use let's write the opposites of the following words slow fast black back front below above loud slow up down tall short crowd alone go come Okay now let's listen read and listen to this two poem with your partner and find out what are thing that the village child and the city child like the village child my home is a, a house near a wood i did live in a street if i could i do wish someone lived near there is no one to play with at all the trees are so high and so tall and i should be lonely for hours were it not for the birds and the flowers next the city child I live in a city in a street it is crowded with traffic and feet there are buses and motors and trams i wish there were meadows and lambs the houses all white in a row there is smoke everywhere that i go i don't like the noises i hear I wish that where woods very near. Okay, good. Now let's talk. The people who live in cities often wish they could live in quiet towns. Do you like the place you live in? Tell your partner two things you like and don't like about the place you live in. Answer. Let's talk. I live in the main city. I like the place where I live. 
then is a developed park with green grass and tall trees i go from walk there there is a school library hospital and a market we have all the things we need there is a local bus stand i can go wherever i like why i don't like however i have to travel a long distance for the main city railway station etc it is a very near to slum area so there is a no proper law and order okay good let's write did you observe that in the poem the last words in every second and fourth line rhyme with each other can you write four line poem yes let's write i live in a tall building like a bird in a nest here i study and here i rest okay second find out how many people are there in our country do you do we have enough land for all people on this earth is there enough food and water for all people there are more than 100 crore people live in our country we do not have enough land for all the people on the earth there is not enough food and water for all the people next find out the following from the families living in your neighborhood count the number f1 f2 f3 f4 5 6 7 8 9 total children below 5 years of age children from 5 to 40 years grown up children from 15 to 20 elders from 20 to 50 years all the people who are above 50 years total number of people in the family f family how many members are educated in each family from amongst the 10 families how many are educated now talk to your partner then write a report about your neighborhood okay next let's interview interview your teacher and get her response for the following questions question number 1 why did you become a teacher i become a teacher because i like teaching i like teaching second how do you come to school every day second question answer i come to school in a auto question number 3 do you have any pets question number 3 answer yes i have a pet question number 4 what kinds of books do you like to read i like to read current events okay question number 5 what are you hobbies what are you your hobbies question number 5 my hobbies are reading books and newspaper traveling and surfing internet okay understand let's interview question and answer okay good now let's interview second question now write a paragraph about your teacher with the information you have gathered my teacher my teacher says 
she become a teacher because a teacher because she likes teaching she likes teaching she comes to school daily in a auto she has a cow and a dog as pets she is a good reader she likes to read current events her hobbies are reading traveling and surfing the internet okay understand good next see use the above map to answer the question what does the dotted line on the map show see dots line ajay house to school what road would ajay take to get the boat club see boat club what building in next to the picnic area what building is next to the picnic area what road passes by ajay's house kasturba gandhi mark what road passes by ajay's house kasturba bhag why other way could ajay used to get from his house of his grandfather's house now write use verb like go turn cross use preposition like across between in front of beside near behind and write how you get home from school okay Let's listen. Do you like to float paper boats? Listen to the poem given below. Day by day I float my paper boats. Day by day I float my paper boats one by one down the running stream. In big black letters I wrote my name on them and the name of the village where i live i hope that someone in same some strange land will find them and know who i am i load my little boats with few flowers from our garden and hope that these blooms of the drowns will be carried safely to land in the night written by rabindranath tagore okay now discuss with your partner how you would send a similar message to someone and next also find out how people sent messages in all done days and how they send them nowadays